Rex, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for being here in the Galaxy Lab. I appreciate it so much. How are you? Megan Roberts, hello. Rex, thank you for those likes. How are you, Megan? B. Ray, welcome. Chadwick, hi. Wayne, thank you for being here. Victor, hello. Ariel A, welcome. Christy Lee, hi. How are you, Christy? Bookie, welcome. Kaylee, hello. Riley, hi. How are you, Riley? Lexi, welcome. Raza, hello. Candace, welcome. Hello, Tay. Tiffany, hi. J, J Bellini SD, welcome. Hello, Tiffany. Hi, Taylor. Basketball star, hello. How are you? Yenno Bird, welcome. Hello. Sarah, hi. No heads up. I literally gave you a heads up. <laughs> Judah, hi. Courtney, welcome. I literally gave you a heads up. Hello, JD. KD and JD, welcome. Gabby, hello. Michael, hi. Candy and Becca, welcome. Welcome to the Galaxy Love, everybody. How are how is everybody? How are you, Riley? Vanessa, hello. How are you, Gabby? Jessica, welcome. Cynthia, hi. Thank you for the taps. Pretty good. Good, Riley. Also, Riley. My girlfriend also thinks 40-year-old is not for you, Riley. No 40-year-olds for you. Thank you for the likes, everybody. Thanks for the double taps. What's going on here tonight, Judah? This is the Galaxy Love. I'm here to answer all your love problems. <sighs> Do you like Latina girls? Um, my girlfriend identifies as Latina, so yes. Emily, welcome. Everyone does. Everyone thinks the 40-year-old is a no-go. Well, Riley, you should listen to everybody. We're all in agreement. no 40-year-olds for you. So let's just say I talk to him, but not about the situation. And then I go sit him like, well, that's great. Hello, Nikki. How does it work? Um, Judah, you just leave a comment and we talk. And if you drop a corgi, I follow you back. And if you want to be a love ranger, click the star, become a love ranger. It's only one lunchable month. Joanna, thank you so much for, for the follow. Nikki, I think you're the longest reigning Love Ranger of all time. Even he does. Asher, thank you for the follow. Why do guys act like they're in love with you but won't commit to you? Um, they're lying. That's why. Sure, hello. But, Nikki, your Love Ranger tag is like silver color. Does that mean, does that mean you're about to expire, girl? I just don't use my TikTok anymore. The fuck, Nikki? Why would they lie and do that to you, though? Um, to use you. <laughs> if somebody is telling you that they love you, they're telling you everything that, they, that you want to hear, but they, they're not committing to you, they're using you. That's why. Whatever it is, whether that's for, for your goodies or for your money, they're using you in some way. So you need to sit, sit down and think about what that could possibly be. And stop giving that to them without commitment. How did this start? Did you did you first contact him or did he contact you? <laughs> you need to model ASAP for real. Well, thank you, Ali. I'm too awkward to model, but I appreciate it. And I'm sorry, Nikki, you should be sorry. Not going live with y'all, sorry. Hello, Amy. What if they use their past trauma as a reason why he can't commit? Um, he can either commit to his past trauma or commit to you. That's what I think. Because they love the attention without committing. People love free stuff. <laughs> um, user 505, they seem like very dismissive or fearful avoidant. And let me let me save you now. Let me save you now, user 505. Don't waste your time on them. Dang, Ken. We got that space. We got space Ken. I think space Ken is one of the is probably the coolest emote that there is. We have new emotes. Y'all can drop them. Come on, come on, stop. Hello, Axel. How are you? Gabby, hello. And we have, um, my girlfriend has her own emote in there. 
Christine, hi. Thank you for the likes. I think Space Ken, masterpiece, masterpiece emo. Um, if you want to use our brand new emotes, become a Love Ranger. It's only one lunchable month, and you can use cute emotes such as Mommy Claws and Daddy Claws. <laughs> Those are cool. Those are cool. Help. Husband is restricting me to going see my family that I might not see again. Silent treatment. Uh, Island Cat, can we find some sort of compromise here? Is he just completely unwilling to compromise? Why is he? Why does he not want you to go see your family? What's going on here? Context. I feel like I'm a mix of avoidant and anxious because I'm like, leave me alone, but no, don't go. Danica, that could be... Um, that could be fearful avoidance, that could be borderline personality disorder, that could be CPTSD. It could be a mixture of things, but it's definitely one of those. <laughs> Kristen, welcome. How are you? Chris, hi. Alex, welcome. I did get diagnosed with CPTSD, by the way. I remember Riley. He can't come with me. He he is labeled as a narcissist. So he's di he's a diagnosed narcissist, which sounds like it. He can't come with you, so he doesn't want you to go. And why can't he come with you? Tell me about CPTSD. So CPTSD usually develops after long-term trauma, um, especially with a narcissist. So if you're in a relationship with a narcissist, it's very common to leave that relationship with CPTSD, a complex post-traumatic stress disorder. So PTSD usually usually comes from a moment. CPTSD is prolonged abuse over and over and over. Trauma over and over and over. So constantly being um, lied to, abused, cheated on can uh, develop a CPTSD, which looks a lot like a fearful avoidance of... Fun, thank you so much for dropping the roses. A fearful avoidance of you sabotage because you're afraid of getting hurt again. You don't want to go through that kind of pain and abuse. So um, one thing, when relationships get a little too um, too real for you, you start to run, shut down, things like that. Sabotage the relationship. What is a good, safe way to meet someone after chatting online in public? Anything in public, Lauren. If you're um, afraid of your safety... And if if you don't feel comfortable meeting someone, do it in public. Do it do it somewhere like getting coffee or lunch, something like that. Axel, thank you so much for the follow. Yeah, CPT CPTSD it is then. It could be, it could be. Um, talk to a therapist. Talk to a counselor. N no NPC rose smell. I'm oh, sorry. Rose is so good. There you go. <laughs> You're not alone. I'm right, I'm right there with you. Forbidden Sphinx, thank you for being here. How are you, Lolo? User 12, hi. MS Cole, welcome. Chelsea, thank you so much for being here. Hi, Sammy. New life, welcome. Don't people with BPD share the same similarities as, as a narcissist, though? Um, not quite. So, narcissism is more so of the world revolves around me, where BPD is more, sh more so um, the world is a disappointment. <laughs> so, borderlines can, can seem narcissistic, but... It's more of a, it's more of a hate you, don't leave me feeling. It's more of a hot and cold push and pull where narcissism, narcissism looks more so like very low empathy of I'm going to do whatever I want. And if it hurts you too bad, you know, deal with it. Um, borderline people, I mean, they can label you, they can call you this and that, but one confronted, a narcissist is more likely to label you and call you insecure and jealous. Where a borderline person, they can care. They can care if if they're hurting you. Like, they they do have empathy, but they can struggle with empathy when they're splitting. 
where a narcissist consistently struggles with empathy. Do you want more fun facts? No, Amy, please no, <laughs> please no more fun facts. Classic narcissism. Hello, Reggie, how are you? You feel like everybody. Fun fact, girl kangaroos have three... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> well, damn. I mean, too bad Nikki's not in here to um, confirm or deny the kangaroo fact. Do you think a narcissist can pretend to be sorry, like they'll apologize, but keep doing the same things? Exact, a hundred percent. A real, a real apology is uh, change behavior. You know, actions over words. Like, thank you for your words, but show me. Like, I want to know that you're sorry by changing. Like, I appreciate the word word apologies, but um, give me give me those actions. Hello, Linda. Lisa, thank you so much for being here. Derek, hello. Shannon, hello. Is is sorry an apology? <sighs> it depends. It really depends. It depends on the context of the apology, what's being said. Like I again, like I appreciate I appreciate the apologies in word form, but I want to see actions. Like I'm not going to I'm not going to break down your apology and belittle your word apology and be like, oh, you don't mean it because I had to blah, blah, blah. Like, I'm not going to do that. As long as your actions back up your apology, that's what I want to see. So no matter what, a male kangaroo should not miss. <laughs> you would think. Hello, Megan. Yeah, I dealt with someone with narcissistic behavior. So hello, JJ. How are you? Lindsay, welcome. Jay, thank you for being here. Elizabeth, hi. Would you forgive a girl if she blocked you because she thought you ghosted her? Um, yes. I would forgive a girl if she blocked me because she thought that I ghosted her. Um, I for I am I'm a very forgiving person personally. I will forgive anything but cheating. I feel, <laughs> which is um a bit of a curse. Like I'm a little too forgiving. It's been way too long. JJ, how have you been? I kept questioning my own reality for for what felt like years. Oh, and hi, sorry, I was not being cordial. Oh, well, Vaughn, thanks for being here. Remember that guy I told you I met, the engineer? Sure, JJ. I like the guy, but I feel like I messed up, but I, but I felt rejected. Well, I'll apologize, Jane. Hope he forgives me. I'm sure he'll forgive you. I hope he forgives you too. He goes to you, well, I'm sorry, JJ. But, um, you know, you know, JJ, I'm sorry, but also, like, good for him. <laughs> just kidding. Hello, Giuseppe. He hadn't even seen my crazy yet. He could just sense it. So happy to see you. How are you, Paige? Thank you for being here. Remo Athens, hello. I'd ask myself, am I just thinking too deeply into this? Handed out chances, like like it would change. Um, I'm guilty of that too. But we want to see we want to see actions. We want to see apologies in the form of actions. <laughs> oh, my New Year's resolution of being nice to you. Sorry, JJ. <laughs> I'm good. Anxiety is bad this week, but I'll live. How are you? I'm great. Paige, thank you for asking. I'm sorry your anxiety is bad, but I hope it gets better. Um, I've heard a so fun thing about anxiety because sometimes I struggle with anxiety. I haven't done this. Hello, Melissa and Tara. Thank you for being here. Um, a self a self soothing um, strategy is taking a cold shower when you're feeling anxious. Hop in the shower, nice and cold. So many ghosts for it to not be Halloween. Fun fact: Napoleon is buried in Napoleon is buried in France. But his family, but wait, hold on. His, it's in New, New, New Jersey. Why the fuck is it in New Jersey? And why the, why the fuck do you know that? I guess the month of love, not ghosts. All I did was get my hopes up. People are what they show you. I agree. Yes, cold showers have helped me so much. That and icing. Um, JJ, no, you should not do that. <laughs> Melissa, thank you so much for the follow. Angela, thank you for the follow. Um, 
that's kind of how I want to go out. Like, if I die before my girlfriend, like, here's the thing. Do I want, do I want to die before my girlfriend slash my wife? Like, do I want to die before my wife or do I want her to die first? Because, I don't know. I don't know. Like, if I were to die first, I wish you were a therapist or something. Um, I'm close. <laughs> Link tree in the bottom, book, phone call, book, FaceTime. If I were to die first... <laughs> I for sure want to get Napoleon. I for sure want to get Napoleon. You know, bury me, but keep your favorite part. You know, make make a necklace. <laughs> Can you want to go first? Do I want to go first though? Like, do I want to haunt her and make sure she's not cheating on me, even though I'm dead? Or would I rather she haunt me? Is the question. Like, that's where I'm going with this. Like, obviously, love wise, like love wise, I want to die first because. I wouldn't be able to live without her. But, you know, can I, can I, can I trust her on earth without me? <laughs> I kind of look up here in your eyes and so hilarious. <laughs> we use the wifey word. <laughs> we had like a hundred people in here at one point. <laughs> Think about how that sounds. I want her to go first. <laughs> <laughs> no, I honestly, in a perfect world, we die at the same time. But <laughs> has the real Jess been in here since last time? How did you know the real Jess came in here, JJ? You were here during that? I saw this thing that said they hope their partner goes first so their partner doesn't have to go through the pain. Aw. That's exactly what I how I meant it. <laughs> <laughs> um no jj she has not been here since i mean i've only been live once since and that was last night and i blocked her user zero four thank you for being here emily hi wait the real jess was here at one point the real jess was here amy thank you so much for the turkey it wasn't last night last night was last time no i'm saying last night was the last time I went live since she was in here? Or the first time? Hello everyone, miss her and hello, how are you? I'm dying with my man, sorry, I am ride or die. Exactly, like hop in the casket, like bury yourself alive, that's how I feel. What did I miss last night? Last night was fun, we had a fun live last night. So many goofy questions, we loved it. Um, we had a brother-sister romance last night. Um, they're pregnant. Fun facts by Amy. Not, I mean, not that fun of a fact. Probably the least fun fact by Amy last night. What can I do to be in your heart? My heart is full. But um, you can hang out with us anyway in the galaxy of love. Thanks for being here. Kellen KP, hello. And then I, <laughs> I love my brother reveal. <laughs> Fun facts we we want but needed. Ew, we are not in one of those states where that's okay. Even I know that <laughs> the gender reveal. Yeah, they um we talked about a gender reveal last night. Annabelle, thank you for being here. How's it going? Uh, Ke Kellen, it's great. How are you? Marley, welcome. We talked about the brother sister love gender reveal. We had an interesting night last night. You missed a lot. If you weren't here last night, you're a sucker. Played yourself. Trace, hi. That's how I feel about every night, though. You just never knew, know who's going to come in here and what kind of problems they're going through. But I'm here to solve them, whatever they are. GJD, hello. Good evening. How are you, Derek? I lost so hard last night. Good. I'm glad you enjoyed last night. Thank you for all those likes, Tiffany. It's always feel good to see you on live. Well, Kellen, thank you for being here. Thanks for hanging out. What are you up to? Shanae Jackson, thank you for being here. Lydia, hello. Also, Amy and Tiffany, you have been bestowed upon 
um, great responsibilities as moderators. You can now, you can now promote subscriptions for people to be Love Rangers. I don't know how. You can pin it somehow, but you're able to do that. Oh, that's hard. Try not not to laugh. It really hurts. Good to know there are, there are people more twisted than me. I wouldn't say that, JJ. Can I have a serious question for you? Hit me with it, JJ. <laughs> Don't mute me. Flexio, hello. Thank you for the likes. Um, somehow you can pin subscriptions. I don't know. I don't know how. Can I do it? I don't think so. Ooh, can we, a subwave. What is a subwave? Oh, we could do a subathon timer. I'll do a little kissy face. I can only use numbers. Um, we'll do... How many... I don't fucking know. You, you can't use only numbers, spaces. This is... I don't want to mess with that. Let me check my powers. <sighs> New black shirt. Hello from Florida. Monica from Florida. Thank you for being here. Why am I not a moderator? I'm loyal to you. Mm, I don't trust you. That's why, JJ. <laughs> Can you miss my question? That was your question. Hello, Dreamer. Your question is why you aren't a moderator, JJ. More positive. Thank you for being here. <laughs> JJ, um, if all 15 of us in here were stranded on an island, you're for sure going in a cage. <laughs> what have I ever done? I'm a nice girl. <laughs> well, hello there from Southwest Georgia, I'm guessing. <laughs> Um, Dreamer, how are you? From Georgia. TikTok still hates you, Vaughn. Why, why Vaughn? Ken, I can bite through the cage. Mm. I will keep that in mind as we all build the cage. <laughs> <laughs> Heidi, hello. How are you? Patty, thank you so much for being here. Mindy Smith, welcome. ML, hello. Hello, Tristan. Austin, welcome. Ken, I'm feral. I can't be tamed. Get over it and accept me as I am. Great here. Thank you. And how are you? Love that smile and giggle. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Dreamer. Thank you for loving my smile. If you're new here, click the follow button. I appreciate it so much. I'm going to try to figure out the subathon thing while everybody drops their questions. Okay, we have the timer. Um... There we go. Two hours? I did not mean, <laughs> I did not mean to, this live is not gonna be two hours long. <laughs> Thank you so much for clicking my little heart person, Tiffany. I love you so much, I appreciate you. My therapist sent me a letter telling me he couldn't be my therapist anymore. <laughs> I'm sorry, JJ. Okay, I'll be honest. I don't know how to do the mod stuff <laughs> except mute. I don't know. Maybe click the star thing, Amy. Maybe if you click the star thing, it'll let you do something. Because I gave you the power. I gave Tiffany the power. And I don't know what the power does. I don't know what it does. Name the number one hint a guy gives when he's just not into you. Um, the number one hint a, a guy gives when he's just not into you is not talking to you a lot. A lot of excuses, a lot of I'm busy, a lot of slow responses, and no no good reason to those slow responses. Oh, cute. Well, thank you, Sashi. Is there such a thing as a lost cause? Did my chat get ghosted? I think so, Vaughn. There is such a thing as a lost cause, JJ, yes. Hello, Laura. Hello, Christy. How are you? Yeah, Bon, I don't see your comment. Hello, Shayla. Connor G, welcome. Hello, Rebecca. It's been so long since I've seen you in here. 
What's with the timer? What did I miss? TikTok hate Yvonne. Uh, do you like two words at a time? I'll figure it out. How are you, Rebecca? Um, I accidentally made a really long timer. So if you become a love ranger, it adds 10 seconds to the timer. So if you're not a love ranger yet, click the star, become a love ranger. It's only one lunch per month and you get love next to your name, just like Vaughn and just like Tiffany and just like Amy. And you get to use cute emotes. This is cute. And brunch daddy. And I'll follow you back. And you get a love ranger color live in front of everybody. Have you heard of Evan F F Fonts? I have not heard of them. Need advice? Well, Rebecca, that's what I'm here for. What advice you need? Hello, Abigail. Mally, welcome. Yipu2002, hello. He's a TikToker. I've never heard of him. Gator Pup, welcome. Tiffany, thank you so much for making those corgis shake their ass. I appreciate you. Damn, all those corgis. Thank you. So many corgis shake their ass. I appreciate it. Five ass shaking corgis. I followed you back, Tiffany. Hello, Ashley. He used to he used to he used to go live. Thank you for all those corgis, Stephanie. I appreciate you. He used to go live all the night, but he doesn't anymore. Wonder what happened? I don't know. I don't know who that is. Rebecca, you got into a car accident. Hello, Ashley. Victoria, welcome. Well, Rebecca, I hope that you're okay and doing well. Christina, hi. How are you? You got a new car and crashed it? I'm sorry, Rebecca. What does the NPC do with corgis? I don't want to know. I don't want to know what the NPC people do with the corgis. <laughs> did you go to the Eras tour? I, did, I didn't go to the Eras tour. Hello, Rachel. Hi, Beverly. I moved out of the way of a semi driving into oncoming traffic. What the fuck? Do you think Taylor Swift is pretty? Taylor Swift is pretty. Hello, Lindsay. Um, she's not my type, but she's pretty. Vaughn, thank you for those likes. Andrea, welcome. I was driving after a storm and thought I hit a, hit a log and it was an alligator. <laughs> Damn. Only in Ohio, I guess, hit the, hit the medium pole in the shoulder getting out of the way. That's insane, Rebecca. That's crazy. A semi going the wrong way. Hello, Jasmine. Like on purpose? They were going the wrong way on purpose? What the fuck? Nikki, welcome. Vaughn, thank you so much for clicking my little heart person. I appreciate you so much. I'm fine. My boyfriend is helping me fix it, but I'm stressed. I mean, I feel you, Rebecca. I'd be stressed too, but I'm glad you're fine. Hello, Carla. What's worse than ghosting is when they won't even block you. Like, what is that? <laughs> okay, I found the powers. You found the powers? Make them work. Hello, Rosie. Ashley, welcome. Make the powers work, Amy. Reality and unicorns, thank you so much for being here. Oh, I mean, I didn't want you to pin your own comment, girl. Pin being a love ranger. <laughs> Terry, welcome. I was showing you. <laughs> Promote me, Amy. You think I you you think I give a fuck about your comments, Amy? Promote Love Rangers. <laughs> Ken, when are you going to Disneyland? I don't know. When are you going to Disney Disneyland, JJ? And that's when I'm not going. <laughs> Rowdy Unicorns, thank you so much for the follow. That's what I want to know. They they keep commenting to you, but they will, but they but they still not into you. You want to know if somebody's still texting you, Dreamer, but they're not into you. 
Are y'all welcome? If you saw me, if you saw me, you wouldn't say hello and give me a hug? No. Mm -mm. I'm not allowed hugging people. Can I leave you hanging on a clap? I will leave you hanging on a clap. <laughs> Hi, Michelle. Thank you for being here. And that's me. Um, sorry. I'll give you an air high five. Jocelyn, thank you for being here. Um, if you, JJ, if you ever saw me in Disneyland, you can, um, you can hug my girlfriend on my behalf. You definitely know me. Is this relationship advice? It sure is. Reality and unicorns. I fully had a dude getting another girl pregnant to get my attention. Well, I love that for you, Rebecca. Southerners are huggers. I mean, I'm a hugger, but I'm taken. I can't be giving hugs. I can't just be hugging people. I'm a, I'm a married man. Can All I can do is pin a message that promotes. Maybe I don't see anything to promote. I'll look. I don't know. Nikita, thank you so much for the follow. Chalet, how are you? Promote your perks. Here we go. Oh, I mean... That's not fun. <laughs> I'd hug your girlfriend first, then you full stop. She'll be okay with it. Um, if I wear a hazmat suit, maybe I can hug you. Yeah, my man hugs a female, I'd be mad. <laughs> Are you watching this new season of The Bachelor? I've never seen any season of The Bachelor. Become a love ranger. Ken needs Lunchables for his in inanimate children. I do need Lunchables for my children. Please become a love ranger and help feed my children. Golden Bachelor for the win. My children do need to eat more than yours do. So for one lunch a month, you can click the star and subscribe and help me feed my children instead of yours. Thank you. What if I hugged you first? I would 1000% be okay with it. <laughs> Sassy, hello. Bless you all here. Marilyn Rose, thank you for being here. Why don't you just say for one Frappuccino a month? Because that's not fun. <laughs> because the reason I say one Lunchable a month is because all of you are single moms and you get that. You, you get the conversion rate, you know? It's like if all my followers were British, I would be like for a scone or I don't fucking know what the British people eat. Do we have a British person in here? A fucking, I don't know, crumpet for one crumpet a month, but you're not British, are you? You're single moms, so lunchable. You understand what a lunchable it converts to. <laughs> My man hugs other women for for TikTok and I low-key try not to be jealous. Your man hugs other women for TikTok. Interesting. Ken, I have no children. I know, shocker, I haven't procreated. <sighs> Baked beans on toast. <laughs> A charity thing? Hugging girls for charity? My girlfriend would never. Mm-mm. Daddy or zaddy? All right, Taylor, thank you for being here. What's a, what's a zaddy? Faith, thank you for being here. St. Jude, Jude, Jude's children, to be fair. Nah, my girlfriend would be like, fuck those kids. <laughs> Does he make really good money for charity? Yeah. How much has your boyfriend made by hugging these women for charity? Ash, thank you for being here. Hi, cutie. Hello, Carol. And how does this work? How do hugs convert into money for St. Jude? I think I think he's bamboozling you. <laughs> you want to talk to Saul? <laughs> I think he's bamboozling you. I'm like, how do, how do we convert hugs into money? Hello, Kaylee. You have to pay to hug me? So I can donate to the children. IMG, hello. What's your boyfriend's TikTok? I want to see the hugs. Yeah, we'll drop his name. Let's go watch these hugs. Wait, can I make money hugging random people? I organize the charity stuff. It's complicated. Next, he'll be like doing the do for charity. <laughs> Let us charge. <laughs> yeah, I could just be like, 
<laughs> I could be like a handsome version version of homeless. I'm just hugging people for tips. <laughs> Cherries or strawberries? Cherry or strawberry flavor? Ooh, it depends. It depends. If we're talking Starburst, strawberry. If we're talking Twizzlers, cherry. If we're talking the fruits, strawberries. Ricky Martin, thank you so much for being here. How are you? Coffee or tea? Tea. Easy. Ariel, thank you for being here. What character would I play if I was casted at Disney? You'd be the guy from Frozen, Hans. Um, if you were a character from Disney, JJ, you'd be... Mm. I don't know. What's like the what's like a really psychotic Disney character? I'm blanking. Sven. <laughs> yeah, welcome. Well, I know what, what I can't use. Elsa? No, uh, no. I wouldn't say Elsa. <laughs> <laughs> what nationality do do I look like? I'm. I really don't know nations. Reality and unicorns. But I will say your nationality is Michigan. Super good man saw the video with you and your woman. So awesome. Well, thank you, Ricky Martin. Um, I don't know. What, what Disney character for you? <laughs> Snow White because animals love me? Mm? No. Or short men, whatever. I mean... I don't know, JJ. That's tough. I don't know a lot of Disney characters. So I'm really, probably like Sid from Toy Story. That's what Disney character you, you would be. <laughs> Hello, Jess, thank you for being here. I think I can block words from the chat. You, you can block words. <laughs> Hello, Joey, how are you? Alicia, thank you so much for being here. Not Jesse from Toy Story, nah. You don't give, you don't give Southern vibes. You give um, Be Mean to Toys vibes. Maybe JJ's the white girl from Princess and the Frog. Um, I don't know who that is. I'd be that creepy old hunchback woman that gave Snow White the apple. <laughs> is it bad if the girl buys the guy flowers? No. Get your boy some flowers. Also drop his TikTok. Or <laughs> Vaughn, you'd be Ursula. Drop his TikTok so we can watch him hugging girls. Hello, Tori. Kathy, welcome. Harold, welcome. Steph, hello. Oh, she was adorable. I'm fine with the color purple. Shame, uh, same. Alicia, thank you so much for the roses. I appreciate it so much. Steph, thank you for those likes. Hello, David. <laughs> You're Ursula, Amy. So not, not not putting him on blast like that. We've only been dating since November. Fine. Fine, Rebecca. But at the very least, you could tag me in a video, you know? I won't tell. I won't tell. It'll just be, it'll be just between the four of us. Me, you, your boyfriend, and my girlfriend will we'll be the only ones that watch. Hello, Tammy. Did you know they're doing a live action nightmare before Christmas? I didn't know that. That's that's two months of us. I could be her. She's sweet. Lynn said, yes, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for those likes. I'll tag you when we do a post together. Well, thank you. But also tag me in his videos of him hugging girls. That's what I really want to see. I want to see all these girls he's hugging. And how much uh, cash he's making for the children, you know? It better be worth it. Hello, Evelyn. Summon subscribers to keep Cat on longer. Click the star, become a Love Ranger. Let's get, let's get like 20 new Love Rangers tonight. Click the star. It's only one lunchable month. I thought you were going to say Aurora because I was in... 
solidarity for six months. Mm -hmm. I mean, no. I'm still st sticking with Sid from Toy Story, JJ. Nuri Latina, thank you so much for those likes. I appreciate it. Hello, Matt. Am I a redhead? My hair is metallic brown. Reality and unicorns, thank you for noticing. Honestly, Ken is Robin Hood. Catherine, hello. The problem with me is I look like every white guy ever. You know, like any, think of any white guy in a movie. That's me. Just got back from the from Mardi Gras. Well, Matt, I hope you had fun. Hello, Annie. Alicia, hello. I'm very, I'm very gen generic, I feel. I feel like you would be perfect in Lord of the Rings. <laughs> User 10, thank you so much for being here. I've never seen Lord of the Rings, but I'm assuming everyone's Scottish. Stealing all the girls' hearts, loving only the the one special one. Lord of the Rings gives everybody Scottish vibes. Thank you so much for the gingerbread man, Vaughn. I appreciate you. Mike, hello. Sorry, I was trying to text boyfriend at the same time. That's okay, Rebecca. That's fine. You can text your boyfriend while you hang out here. Hello, Kayla. He's busy hugging people. Damn. The vegan tea, thank you so much for being here. How are you? Paige, hi. Hello, Chris and Lolo. Michelle, welcome. Christine, hello. Ali, hello. Your reception gave up, Paige. Well, thanks for coming back. Oh, I'm the only one he watches The Notebook with. Well, I guess he's winning. My girlfriend still hasn't watched The Notebook with me. It's sad, really, if you think about it. You live in the sticks. I mean, I feel you, Paige. <laughs> I love the notebook same. And I just have to watch it alone all the time. So my girlfriend doesn't love me. Hello, Jeremy. Thank you for being here. Jessness107, welcome. Your husband won't watch it? We'll make him watch it. How are you, Jeremy? You don't think you've seen it? Notebook makes you cry every time. I cry at least four times watching the notebook. Bribe her with snacks. Hello, Justice. He picked it tomorrow. He's coming over and watching Princess Bride. Um, for sure, the ending, the, literally anything, literally every moment of the notebook, I cry. There's at least there's at least four times I cry watching that movie. Beatrice, thank you for being here, but I'm a little I'm a little baby when it comes to love. I woke up this morning not feeling well. Well, Jeremy, what's going on? You you feeling sick? Investor girly, hello. TJ, welcome. I can't get my man to watch Brokeback Mountain. <laughs> I mean, look, Brokeback Mountain, Brokeback Mountain is a sad movie. A real man will watch a romantic movie, I agree. Mel Mel, hello. I drank five beers last night when I should have just manned up and manned up and spoke to her. I was glitching. I like the story, so it made me cry. Also, yeah, yeah. I don't remember. I don't think Brokeback Mountain made me cry, but it's a very sad movie. A lot better now, oh, Jeremy. I'm glad you. I'm glad you're doing better. Hello, Cindy. Be worth hello. Did someone die in Brokeback? Um, no spoilers. Um, <laughs> Reed, welcome. We're not gonna spoil movies in here. Princess, hello. How are you, Sydney? 
My ex's favorite movie movie was Five Foot Apart. Makes sense now considering they're they were dissatisfied. <laughs> Um, is Five Foot Apart the one with the Zach, the guy from Zack and Cody? Still, Magnolia skits me every time. Where he falls in love with a girl who has like this disease and he can't come within five feet of her. That's also that's also a sad movie. That movie made me cry. I had the Sonic peanut butter bacon burger and the peanut butter bacon shake. It was delicious. That sounds amazing. That sounds so good. Sunny be fun. Welcome. How are you, Kristen? Gladiator makes me cry. I've never seen Gladiator. Who is Zack and Cody? The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody. User96, welcome. Hello, Heather. Armageddon makes me cry every time. I don't think I've seen Armageddon either. How old am I? Um... Let me count. I am 30 and 29 months old. It's a re Is it a reality TV show? It's a Disney show from back in the day. Hold on. <laughs> Hello, Maggie. Thank you for being here. Are we getting to? There's so many good ones. I'm trying. How are you, Nikki? 30 and what? I'm 30 and 29 months old. Hello, Kimmy. She sent me a screenshot of, of the place. Hi, Amanda. Almost 30, 30. They emailed her. Oh, uh, your, your girl good in the tummy talk. Hello, Tom. Your girl good in that $100 tummy talk. You're from California? I think we're the same age, 30, 33. No, I'm not 33. Gortella, welcome. Matthew, welcome. Almost. How are you? I'm great. How are you? I want to hang out with someone and they told me they were 20. Well, damn, Rebecca. Rebecca, let's mm, not. Some things we don't we don't say on the internet, Rebecca. <laughs> and that's that's one of them. <laughs> keep keep that to yourself. <laughs> um yeah, she is she's going for the tummy tuck or mommy makeover. I'm going I'm going back to California as soon as possible. Two more days. What's up? How are you, Zach? Saru, thank you for so much for being here. Sherilyn, welcome. Okay, okay, Rebecca. That's better. <laughs> A very, very important part of the story. <laughs> How much are tummy, tummy tucks? I don't know how much tummy tucks are, but I don't think they're a hundred bucks. You have a new boy, boyfriend, Sherilyn? Thank you for the likes, everybody. <laughs> Spicy. That's important info to include. Very important info to include in that story. Never, never tell that story again without starting the story with your age of that story. <laughs> I saw the screenshot that says $90 flat rate special. <laughs> Patience, thank you, thank you so much for being here. Noted. <laughs> Mrs. Pies, thank you so much for being here. Hello, Kathy. <laughs> That's how to start it. That's definitely how to start it. <laughs> That's 100% how to start that story in the future, Rebecca. <laughs> Nico, thank you so much for being here. Hello, Linda. Jewel, hello. All of us being like, hello. Is this <laughs> exact? Yeah, Chris Hansen starts, shows up at your next, your next meeting, Rebecca. <laughs> Thank you for the likes, everybody. Anna, welcome. Thank you for the likes. Click that follow button if you're new. 
Hello from the most unwanted state of South Dakota. Well, Mrs. Pies from South Dakota, thanks for being here. Hello, Tanya. Thank you for the likes. Tranquility, welcome. Nurse Linda, hello. What's it like being s s stuck in snow? Yo, Merlis, thank you for the follow. Um, and apparently we're supposed to be getting life-threatening floods here in California. So if your if your boy gets flooded, if your bo if your boy dies in a flood, sorry, you know. That's what happens when you don't drop corgis for me or click subscribe and become a love ranger. I die in a flood. Princess, thank you so much for the follow. I want to go back to visit so badly. I moved to Michigan three months from Arizona, so I don't deal with snow. You're located in California? Yeah, bruh. Just be sure to live stream it. Live stream me drowning in a flood? What part of California? I was San Francisco to Arizona. Right now? I'm in Orange County, bruh. To the guy who invented zero, thanks for nothing. <laughs> Massive views of me drowning in the flood. Hello, Kat, how are you doing? I hope the night is good. Well, thank you, Kathy. You're the most beautiful thing my eyes have been ever been able to see. Well, thank you. Thank you so much for thinking I'm the most beautiful thing that your eyes have ever seen. Ken, in your opinion, which state slash city has the best looking men? Orange County is a nice area. The which city city or state has the best looking men? Hello, Brittany. Thank you for being here. I don't know. Beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> Cincinnati, Ohio. The coast states. I think California, New York. Australia has the best looking men, like Utah. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. They're all gorgeous, just in different ways. Okay, thank you for being here. I don't know. I can't give my opinions. I like nothing's jumping out at me. Like I feel like dudes just look the same everywhere. <laughs> Not Michigan, that's for sure. Who has the most beautiful women? My man's from Cincinnati, so I'm biased. <laughs> Jess, Matt, welcome. The ones in South Dakota tend to have round faces. Miami, Ken's like, well, I'm in California, so I am in California. And my girlfriend is the most beautiful girl on the entire planet. So I guess California wins by default. Korean, thank you for being here. You're in South Dakota. So many South Dakota people in here. Depends if you're looking for something serious or not. What part of California? I'm in Orange County, bruh. Surfing waves. Is your girlfriend there? Can we say hi to her? Um, no. She'll never go on live with me. Can be in bias also. <laughs> Alex, thank you for being here. Um, she will strictly never go live with me. Ever. Mom, just doing I Thank you for serving here. Greetings from Dallas. Beautiful baby. Oh, thank you. If you want a good time, only look in Brazil. You live in Laguna Niguel. I don't know where that is, JJ, but that's awesome. Why? Um, she doesn't She doesn't want to be on live. I don't know. You used to live in San Bernardino, Redlands, Sacramento. Well, nice. OC, oh, yeah, I... I get that, JJ, but I don't know where. I don't know where it is, though. So. Oh, thank you for being here. I was in Ventra for a year. Do you know Brett? <laughs> what the fuck? Just a random ass name. Brittany, thank you for being here. Hello, fans. The water is warm. All right, your boy's going to bed. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Click that follow button if you're new. Follow me on Instagram at SuperKenGaming. Drop those corgis and I'll follow you back. If you want a phone call or FaceTime, link to in the bio. Book a phone call. Book a FaceTime. Um, I love you all so much. Sweet dreams. I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye, everybody. Actually, I won't see you tomorrow. Tomorrow's Sunday. Goodbye. I love you. What's the dating world like now? Single for 10 months after 8 years. I'm scared. 
Um, Paige, it's awful. The dating world is awful. So um, have fun. It's going to be shitty. It's not going to be easy. Um, you're in a relationship slash married for eight years and now you're single. It's awful. It's awful. But you can do it. Just keep hanging out with us, Paige. Keep hanging out with us. Keep um, coming in here for, for advice when you need it. You're married. It's it's horrible. It's horrible out, out there. But um, we're here for you, Paige. We're here for you while you find your forever person. Dating is hookup culture. For the most part, I agree. Your prices change for a phone call? They sure have. My prices have changed. Um, but I love you all so much. Thank you for hanging out. Sweet dreams. Goodbye, everybody. And we're here for you. It's tough. Eight years of marriage into the single world. We'll pray, we'll pray for you, Paige. But you'll find somebody. Sweet dreams. I love you all so much. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.